King. And before the break, we got this strange mailbox surprise of broccoli and concealer. Rossi, what is going well, on? Well, you know what? I actually <laughs> sent this in to the news team because I saw it online and I loved it. People Magazine reports that a vegetable is the star of this viral beauty hack, broccoli freckles are going viral on TikTok. All you need to create these faux freckles is some broccoli and some concealer. You dip a little floret of broccoli into the, the um, concealer, like a little color a little darker than your skin tone. Oh my God, it's perfect. Oh my God, it's perfect. Oh my God, just... it's perfect. Sorry, I just spent like 20 minutes in the sun. I look so cute with my freckles. Look how cute this actually, I look like my Cabbage Patch Kid. <laughs> When I see people do the the, the freckled trend, they kind of do it like here and here. I know a couple people have gotten these tattooed on permanently, like freckles. Can I tell you something? Yeah. It looks so cute on you. I Wait, can't I'm, even I'm handle it. I really like it. Right? Too. Really would you like do this it. in real life? I mean, now I would. Yeah. Hello. This is a Joey, little crudite. Is that better? Is it crudite or crudite? Crudite. A little crudite board. I can yeah. Turn into the whole glam team. Yours looks so good. I. I I feel like I overdid mine. I overdid no, mine too. Think, it started cute, then it no, turned into like a disease of some sort. Like, <laughs> I need to see a doctor. Yeah. I think, I think the placement's wrong. I think you guys have to go in towards the inner bone you of the it. nose. All Perfect. I know is that Joey's looks amazing. Yes. And I don't know about this. What can I say, guys? I know how to work my way around vegetables. You really, oh. really, really do. All right. Well, finally. Now I just want to keep going. Speaking of broccoli, it is time for food news. Oh. <laughs> okay. This story. Can you take this story? Yes. Okay, so MASH reports that Emma Stone's McDonald's order is going viral online for being, in her words, depressing. Emma said, quote, it's just the meat and the bun and the fries and then a McFlurry. We have her not so happy meal here. And what do you guys think? Do you think this is a depressing McDonald's order? I mean, she said it herself. Yes, I think she's just being pithy and playful, but apparently the rumor is that she would eat these every day making the film Poor Things, yeah. really? for which she won her second, second. Oscar yeah. in only a matter of a few years. Yeah. So, nothing depressing about that. I'm excited to try it. Cheers. Cheers. I mean, really? I, I did I, I'm. you're so sweet and optimistic and lovely because this is probably the most depressing order in the world. It looks like a punishment, right? Like I do something wrong? Joey King, I don't want to break it to you, but I worked at McDonald's. I've said it here before, drive through register, and grill. What do I call myself, Drew? Triple threat. Thank you so much. I know a lot about McDonald's, and I used to express myself through sauce. I'd make my own burger. They called me Sauce Matthews. Mm -hmm. I, yes, I would put Big Mac sauce on a hamburger. That's called cheating the system. Yes. Emma Stone, I really, I want to, good, I want to so take good. Emma Stone to McDonald's and show her and a show thing her or two. I, I know you have two Oscars, but I know McDonald's, Emma. Let me take you. You know what I didn't bring with me? To dip my fries in my McFlurry, but I don't know if anyone if anyone remembers my last visit on on Drew's show. We made the, the Kugel. We made Kugel, and I brought my dairy pills because I have a big dairy intolerance. Well, today <laughs> I did not. <gasps> <laughs> You know what? So we'll, we will see what happens. Oh. <laughs> I'm not kidding. This was me the other night. <laughs> After eating a pint of ice cream, I kid you not, this was me literally going, I need to go to the hospital. <laughs> I need to go to the hospital. I don't know if this is gas or a lactose intolerance, but I Wait. am going to die. Well, Joey's co-star out from We Were the Lucky Ones, the one and only Logan Lerman will be here. And um, we're gonna get into Joey's wedding and we're gonna ask Lo Logan who just got engaged himself. All things romance, we have so much. We'll be right back. <laughs>